So I was on this uh, filter job, this whole pump system really, uh, about two weeks ago. And I got a call and the builder said I put the filter in the wrong location. I actually put the filter exactly where the homeowner wanted me to put the filter, but other things got put in the way. I hate it when you do really, really good work and then you have to go and rip it all out and then put it somewhere else. Let me show you this. So this is my filter. Now, mind you, none of this was here. None of that was here when I was here. And uh, while we were drilling the well, the homeowner walked in here and told me he wanted it mounted right here. Easy, accessible for him to be able to change it. So I went ahead and drilled holes through the concrete block, mounted me a board, mounted my filter, made it all look nice and neat. And then I got a phone call that said it was in the way of the porch. So now I have to go and redo all this just to move the filter right here. That's where he wants it. I hate it when you do a good job and then you gotta undo it all. See so if we go over here and go under the house. This was my tank setup. So basically you come out of the ground and you got your tank and then went up with one inch pecs and you follow the one inch pecs all the way down. And then I'm going in the wall there. And then I'm coming out the wall there, hooking up to their three quarter inch line. So now I gotta redo all this and drill new holes. Fun stuff. So as I'm drilling the hole, I discover they put rebar in the center block. Okay, we are back under the house. So these right here, that is my old port and my old sleeve. And that one is my new sleeve and my new sleeve. So this right here is coming out of the tank and into the filter. That one's gonna go out of the filter and into the house. So I've already connected right there. I gotta go get some pipe clamps and clamp it to the uh, floor joist. And then I gotta cut this pipe here and connect this over to that. So that's what I'm heading to do next.
Okay, we are back under the house and the exit pipe, which is right there. The white pipe, you can follow it all the way. And I made my connection right there. So now everything under the house is done and everything in the garage is done. All I have to do is caulk the holes and clean up. If you notice, I put gray caulk on the uh, block and I put white on the pipe. It's the little details. watching the video heading out now going to the to the drill site got to finish cutting a hole to 400 foot but I had to come over here and get this done once I have this done now the uh, contractor will go ahead and pay the bill so that was kind of holding up the money so it needed to be done well if y'all like my content please sure to give it a thumbs up hit that subscribe button share any of the footage that you like on any of your social medias I know that's asking a lot for people but that's really the only way that my channel will actually grow but hope y'all have a good one. See y'all next time.